Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Welcome, if you're new to my channel, my name is Carla and on this channel I share videos on fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. If you enjoy these kinds of videos, then please subscribe down below. Okay guys, so today I'm creating a shopping list. Is that what you would call it? Yeah, a shopping list. So if you don't know, today is October 27th and tomorrow, Brandon Blackwood releases his fall collection. So I'm actually on his Instagram right now and it says it's the fall collection and restock tomorrow, 1028 at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So pretty much if you've been looking for the Kendrick trunk bags, tomorrow is your day to get it. If you've been looking for any of the handbags, I recommend that you go ahead and you check out Brandon Blackwood's website tomorrow. Okay, now that we got that out of the way, let me show you guys really quickly the things that I'm adding to my shopping list. I like to create a shopping list when I know for a fact I'm gonna purchase items and I just don't wanna be on the website the day something comes out. Knowing that these items usually sell out, I don't wanna be on the website trying to figure out what I am going to get. And sorry if I look all tired. I am tired. Um, I just got home from work, so. Yep, this is what you get after work. This is after work, Carla. Okay, so. Pretty much, I know for a fact that I want that bamboo handbag. And let me just see where it's at. There's a, a bamboo handbag that I want. I've been wanting the card holder, but if you watch my recent, I don't even know how recent it is now, but I shared a Brandon Blackwood unboxing and I had picked up a wallet then but this is it right now. This is it right here. So it's the Bamboo B Tote. This one is 375 US dollars. And I set a limit to myself. Like when I'm creating these shopping li lists, there's a budget, a limit that I will spend. And I think I'm gonna be like, my budget is, is $1,000. I don't wanna spend any more than that. So yeah, this is one of the items that I'm adding to my shopping list and if you can see guys this bag it's just beautiful i just love the black and gold detail it speaks it speaks to me it has a strap as you can see you can wear it top handle and it's just a statement piece so i'm definitely adding this to my list one thing i wanted to look at really quickly were the sunglasses um, if you didn't know, I've been like into sunglasses. Not that I wasn't before, it's just that I wear regular eyeglasses and sometimes it's difficult to wear sunglasses. Most of my sunglasses, I have to get prescription added to them, so it's a little bit tricky. But I've been thinking, or I was thinking about getting a pair of sunglasses. And these are the ones I think I wanted to get. They're the J Sunglasses and they're in the color green something fun as you guys know by now green is the it color like that emerald green it color and i feel like these glasses would pair very well with a lot of my green outfits this one is 80 dollars, and i think i'm gonna add that one on there another one that i wanted and i know it's so different like this bag is not your usual um i i just don't know which color to get i don't know which color to get and because i'm dropping this vi this video literally i'm gonna film this video i'm gonna edit it and i'm gonna share it with you guys if you can just help me to select which color in this bag it's the arlen bag this is it in blue it's the blue mesh. I just don't know. So it comes, this is how it looks, right? So it looks like a mini bag. It looks like I could definitely fit at least my cell phone, my car keys, and maybe a couple wallets or like a key, like a card holder. It does actually look like that would fit in there. It has a strap, as you can see. I just love the detail on this bag. Like I really do like it. It's, it's one of those things where you get the aesthetics 
but it looks like this bag does serve serve some purpose. Um, let's see what it says. Our Arlen bag in blue mesh with vegan leather. Details featuring an exaggerated zipper and it's in silver hardware. But yeah, as you can see right here, so it comes in brown, it comes in green, it comes, and it comes in pink. And I think I want the mesh one. Something about the mesh. Like, yes, it, it's here. The Arlen bag is, as you can see right here, this one isn't the mesh, but I want the mesh one. It's just which color. I think I'm gonna do, I don't know, it's between, it's honestly between the green and the brown. I think I'm gonna do the green, but I'm not 100% sure yet. I'm definitely adding this to my shopping list, but I just don't know which color I'm gonna end up getting. I want to look at the bamboo tote again and this is what I do I just I try to make sure that I know for sure what I'm gonna get and actually let me share with you guys what it says here so this bag has hand sewn double stitch it's a hand sewn double stitch handle um, gold bamboo hardware trim which we saw that internal slip and zipper pockets adjustable detachable leather crossbody strap and it does come with a dust bag for anyone who likes, you know, putting their bags or like storing their bags in their dust bags. It does come with a dust bag. This is 100% genuine leather. Um, and the lining is microfiber suede fabric. I'm actually so, like, I cannot wait to purchase this handbag. I'm looking through and I looked through fairly quickly. Like I knew I wanted those three items for sure, and then I knew I knew there was one more thing. I think I'm gonna get this one in brown. It's the Court Courtney bag, brown leather with brown wool. It has the Jockamoose vibe. Like if you've ever seen that straw bag, I'll see if I can find it and I'll put it right here, um, so you guys can kind of see what it is I'm talking about. But this definitely. Scream Jackamoose, but guys, look at that. Do you see that? Like the wool, it doesn't look like you're just getting a little bit. Like this bag looks like quality. The leather on this bag, let me read the material. 100% genuine smooth leather. And you can see it in that image. Like the material on that leather it just looks smooth. It, it, it looks very rich. And I love the brown with the gold here hardware. Definitely getting this. Look at that wool. This is not this is not your average piece. This is definitely going to be like your statement piece. So whatever outfit you wear, this bag is the statement. This is what you're going to be telling people about is this bag. It does come as you can see here in green and black, but I I think I do prefer the all brown so yeah i think i want the all brown and so far like i know i set my budget at a thousand and this is always my problem is i don't know how to stick to my limit i don't know how to stick to my limit i wanted another esr tote bag i just don't know what color i want it in i do not know the brown wax is nice I try to like, whenever I'm buying these kind of handbags, I try to think of colors that I don't have. Like my Telfars, I have so many colors that I have to be very careful as to which bags I get because these bags are square in nature, like that box square kind of detail. And I just don't want too many of the same colors. I'm thinking maybe the metallic purple. Actually, I'm lying. I know exactly which one I am going to get, and it is the red canvas. So I'm gonna get the red canvas, this one right here. I just like swiped out, but I actually do want you to see it. This one right here. I already have it in the regular canvas, but I want the red canvas one. So that's another one I'm gonna get. And I think I want a Kendrick trunk. I want to, I'm showing you guys, like, I'm going through this very quickly because, again, this is how I shop. But, ooh. I don't know yet. I do not know yet about this Kamal bucket bag, but 
I really like it. I just don't know, like, if I would style it well. Or, like, how I would style it. I have the Telfar shopping bag in the that collab with Telfar and Ugg. So, I probably wouldn't get this bucket bag. I think I want a bucket bag. I just don't know which bucket bag I would get. So, there's, like, this puffer one. You just saw the one with the shirling fur. And then this orange one is more of like, a, it has that puffer material. And then you have uh, a couple that are suede. So this suede one, this brown one, comes here, as you can see, in brown. And then it also comes in black, as well as in blue. So these are $225. I'm sharing all of this on the screen, so hopefully you guys can see what I'm seeing um, yeah it just I need to figure out which one you guys know I love me some orange too I love me some orange all right here are the Kendrick trunks so again it's just figuring out which color I want so right now I'm looking at them you have the suede Kendrick trunk and these are hundred and depending on the size depending on the size I think it ranges from like hundred and sixty five dollars to hundred and eighty five dollars so you have it in suede you have it in terry cloth um, and then you just have different prints it's, it's in leather as well denim shirling they have it in puffer now like that puffer almost like a puffer coat that puffer kind of look um, I just need to figure I've always wanted the cow print one I just don't know if the cow print is like how often would I wear it if I got it because these bags I'm trying to purchase I want to purchase things that yes they can be like statement pieces but I want them to just have some kind of purpose for me this is the one right here. And sometimes I like scrolling very quickly when I'm looking through these things because if it stands out like as I'm scrolling very fast, then I know that that's the one for me and this is it. So this is the Kendrick trunk um, in purple. The material is premium vegan grain leather and the lining is a microfiber suede fabric. This one costs $165. So. I think I'm gonna get that so it's just hard like it's just hard like to set a limit it's good to set a limit in life but it's hard to actually follow that limit and that's something I go through and guys like do you see how many things are getting ready to drop tomorrow like it's insane and I don't know how fast it's gonna sell out I'm sharing this with you guys because Sometimes, like, you guys will ask me, oh, how did you get that? Or, you know, when did they release? Do you know when they're gonna release again? These are, This is for my subscribers that love Brandon Blackwood, and they've been trying to get their hands on a Brandon Blackwood handbag. Tomorrow, October 28th, at 8 p.m. Eastern time, is your time to get your hand on a Brandon Blackwood handbag. Um... I think that was pretty much all the stuff that I wanted. I'm still going through everything. This is a cute little bag. Like it's not for me, it's called the Kuei. I'm not sure if I'm saying it right. K-U-E-I bag. It's very cute, you can tell it's like a mini bag, but it's just, it's not my vibe. This one goes for $155. There was like this tote that I really liked. Was it this one? I'm not really sure. I'm not sure. Let's look at it. So this is in green suede. This is very like nice for any of you that want a work bag. The like you can see the quality you're going to get just from the picture. So you get, I think that's probably either a sunglass case or maybe just like a key pouch. You get another pouch and then you get the handbag. Again, in suede, let's see what it says. Detachable crossbody strap, genuine suede, like I said, and it's silver hardware. You don't, I don't think um, 
you get much gold hardware from the Brandon Blackwood items. Oh, what is this? You get a market tote. A lot of, from what I've noticed, and I love Brandon Blackwood, clearly I'm getting ready to shop from his collection, but some of, not a lot of, I'm sorry, some of his things do kind of remind me of the Louis Vuitton products. Like the holder or the, the unboxing that I did of Brandon Blackwood, I shared like the six ring key holder, which is for, like similar to the one from the Louis Vuitton. And now I'm looking at this medium Cara um bag like i'm looking at these bags and they almost have like a speedy a speedy kind of vibe if you have louis vuitton handbags and you like shopping from louis vuitton you'll you'll know what i mean it kind of gives off that vibe and i'm not even gonna lie to you i'm here for it i'm here for it i'm especially here for this green bubble dark green bubble leather handbag I wish oh there like it shows the inside but it doesn't really show the inside I really I I do like it I I am here for it I'm not gonna lie it does look it does look very nice but it's not really something that I'm looking for right now let's see what else do we have I'm probably like over over my limit right now And again, I'll write everything down so that I have everything so that when it releases, I can just either search it in the search bar right here, go up there and search it. Let's see, but yep, search it right here, whatever it is that I'm looking for, or just hop on the pages and start skimming through it really quick. I will say this is very cute. I saw this and it's very, very cute. This is the mini Kendrick trunk in the straw wicker. This screams summer to me. Like this with a cute maxi dress. I really like this bag. I actually do like this. I might be adding her to my shopping list. I might be adding her to my, ooh, look at this. So I just noticed this. They've definitely been adding things to the site the last couple of days because I've been like, I've gone through the site trying to figure out what I want, but this, so this is the blue rhinestone Kendrick trunk. This one is $350. This almost gives off like the Prada, the Prada vibe. Obviously it's a square, it's a trunk bag. It's the square shape. The Prada one is more of like that 90s, you know, what would you even call that? It's more of like, it's not structured like this. It's like a, cil not cylinder, but it's a different kind of shape. But the rhinestone is why I say it's kind of like, it gives off that Prada vibe because Prada's handbag has the rhinestones on it. Ooh, they have it in green. This is very nice, guys. This is a very, look at the details on this bag. That green, that emerald green. Huh. Your girl might be adding this. Your girl, I think I'm gonna get, so yeah. I probably will end up getting that rhinestone handbag, the green one. I, I really like that green. And I could just see myself wearing it with like a slip dress, maybe from Zara, like Zara has has like that, those slip dresses that are really good quality. I picked one up, not, I picked one up not too long ago, an all black one. And I really do, I really do think that I may get that. So the Sophia bag, I've, I don't know. I like them. They're very, very pretty, but I don't know if they're like too dressy for me. I like bags that you can dress up, but you can also wear casually. Like, yes, you can wear anything casually. You definitely can, but I 
I don't know if this bag is for me. It's pretty and I love this gold chain detail. I really, I actually do like this gold chain detail. I just, I don't know. I don't know. It's pretty. This one is $200. I like the gold I do like the gold hardware because like I mentioned you don't get much go oh. stop it stop it this blue croc embossed one with the gold hardware I need help I need help I have to think about this one it's very pretty. It's very pretty. Shout out to Brandon Blackwood for doing his thing. Let me just let me just drop that in this video. Like shout out to Brandon Blackwood because he is doing his thing. Like he created these bags. They took off and he he just he just ran with it. Like he just kept producing handbag after handbag after handbag and they were pretty much hits after hits after hits so shout out to brandon blackwood look at this belt bag that he made out of the the kendrick trunk bag i have this one if you saw the unboxing i do have this this bag as the trunk bag and i like it as the belt bag as well this is cute i wouldn't get it but this is cute the maya bag it's cute but i don't I don't think I'm gonna get it. So this is the pouch I was telling you guys about that I unboxed that looks like the six ring key holder. It's the Nima key pouch. This is actually available to purchase still, like at the moment. And I do really like it. I do really like it. If you haven't seen my video yet, go check that out. I share it like that not only are you gonna, you can, not only do you put your keys in that holder, there's like a slot in the pouch that helps you hold cards as well. So definitely check that video out. These are this bag is for my handbag lovers. It's called a Portmore backpack in green leather. And as you can see, I've been gravitating to the greens. Um, not only because I like the color green, but but because as well, like I mentioned, green that color is trending. It's like it's trending. I like this backpack. I'm not gonna get it, but I do like it. And this is the Sophia bag. This bag is a little bit bigger. So this is the shape I was talking about when I said, you know, the Prada, that trunk bag with the rhinestone that reminded me of the Prada bag. This is the shape that I was talking about. And this is the SYL bag. This is in black nylon and this one is for $150. And I think that is about it. So I feel like I'll do pretty decent um, price wise. Like I feel like I'll do okay because like I said, I'm gonna get, so I'm getting the black and gold bag. I'm gonna get the mesh bag. I'm gonna get a Kendrick trunk bag. I'm going to get the rhinestone bag. And I think I'm missing another one. But I feel like limit wise, I, I did limit myself to $1,000. I feel like I'll be pretty much right at the mark that I wanna be and I'm okay with it. I've been wanting a couple more Brandon Blackwood handbags I wanted to share with you guys. One, what I'm gonna be getting, cause you know, some of you do enjoy the pieces that I get and I wanna share with you guys what I plan on getting so that you guys can get them as well. So that's one. And two, I wanted to let you guys know that all of these items drop tomorrow again tomorrow october 28th at 8 p.m and don't say i didn't tell you <laughs> don't please don't say i didn't tell you because tomorrow october 28th at 8 p.m all of these items will be dropping i hope you enjoyed this video i hope you found it helpful i know it was more of like the things that i'm adding to my list but i i still do hope that you found this video helpful and me sharing with you guys some of the things that Brandon Blackwood will be releasing. If you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comment section down below. If you want to help me out in picking out which color 
um, mesh bag to get. Also, let me know in the comment section down below. Remember to be kind to yourself and be kind to others. Love yourself and love others as well. Also, remember to follow me on Instagram, guys. Follow me on Instagram at Carla.Simon19. I share fashion content like outfit of the days and things like that on my Instagram, Carla.Simon19. See you in the next video.